All right, welcome everybody to this week's week nine matchup between the New York Giants versus the New England Saints. So last week did not work out well as there was a disconnection in the middle of play. Honestly, we are shocked. That's the second straight week that the connection ended. But we had figured out there was a neck internal network. Let's head it down to our in-game announcers. I'll only give reactions to plays that I think are ridiculous and that should be yeah. Once again today, he connected on over 60% of his throws last week. First down on the way. The Giants come out with a split backfield. Made by the catcher's catcher's the There's no doubt, time of possession can be an overrated stat in games many times. But one thing Steven, you want to do, throw and catch it just like this to pick Watch up those play, first play. downs and keep it going. First down at the 49. Play fake. To Williams. Complete to Williams. What a way to start the game on offense. Just picking up another first down for them. They are in rhythm, and now no matter what they call, they're going to feel like they're going to make it happen. Zebra, zebra. Man, man. The jumbo gun, gun, gun. set on the field. Eli Mack will take it from the center here. Still got it after the play action. Has to extend. Yes. He's pumped for the touchdown. You see it so often now. If the receiver's not open, just throw it high, let him go up in the air, jump, make the catch. That's what we saw here. Nice, nice touchdown. The Saints have themselves in a hole early. Let's see if their offense can respond on its first drive. The scores. Uh, I need to turn something down. Fields the football at the three. And he there we go. One. Ah, see us coming out of that. There we go. We'll let have that five cents. Tackle just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22 yard line. And now we've got what you call the widely petrified quarterback about to head onto the field for the first time today. Yeah, when you're a quarterback like this and get ready, you've had success, you're ready. You're on the field, you can't Boom. wait for the game to start because you better think only good things are going to happen to them. So they're confident and ready to go. Here's a look at the Saints offense. Will they finally find a way to run up and down the field? So far on the year, it's been boring. Brent 38! Brent 38! Second and 10. Throws to the right. Has his target. Tackles made, and the first down is picked up. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Tim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. We're going to work. We're going to work. Get ready. Up, up, up. Now first and ten. Mark Ingram carries the football. Moore's able to read that play and make the hit. Here's the Giants' defense. They have not stopped the run all season long. When you can't stop the run, you can't win. Will it be Let's different today? Can they find a way to win the battle at the line of scrimmage? and slow down the rushing attack. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home, they stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. 
and Morgan. They're passing. Let's go. The slot. Hey. Third and nine. He's taken down. We got to give that defensive front a lot of credit, man. They are pushing. They're getting after it. They know it's probably going to be a pass on third down, and they get back to the quarterback and take him down. down here hey, looks like the Giants like come out in a jumbo no, set no, no. Manning's able to fake it to the line and still has it oh, nice catch when you talk about Ooh. this giant offense and Eli Manning they love to throw the football down the field not afraid to take chances and that time Eli showing off that arm strength right on target Nickel formation for the defense here. Almost intercepted. Here's our look at the Giants offense, starting with the offensive line that knows how to look after its quarterback. They have not only protected him, they have freed him to lead this team down the field with a dangerous passing attack. He's brought down at the 25-yard line. And now here's the Saints defense. This is a ball hawking unit that a week ago came up with four takeaways. There's a lot of extra weight out there for this jumbo set. And Jennings lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. Oh, and almost picked off that time. Wow. Well, the offense didn't pick we up need first back the first down. They're, they're pretty happy the way everything turned out because that pass could have been intercepted. And you give an interception up on third yeah. down, and yeah. that is bad. The Giants bring in an extra tight end for this play. Right way through the first. Oh, that scoring player. That's a missed opportunity, uh. and now they'll have to bring out the defense. That is called rolling the dice, and that's what it is. It's a big right. gamble by the right. offense and the coach. You go for it on fourth down, you don't make it, now you're going to pay the price. They bring in the extra tight end. Well, let's go. Two times, two times. Right. The Saints will take the snap from the 25. And Ingram handed the football. Taken down at the 33. When I was a quarterback, I loved it when they called the draw play because I know that defensive line, they're all trying to go after the quarterback and nobody's prepared for the run. Four down, four down. Second down and two. The run up with Mark Ingram. They are in the backfield in a hurry. And we'll go, bring him down for a loss behind do, the line of scrimmage. They don't want none of this. The Saints facing third down. A week ago, they were not up to the challenge. Get ready. Hey. Third and four. The pass doesn't find a mark. All set to punt here. Oh, Beckham's going to receive from me. going to give his team great starting field position on that return. Beckham's able to show off his talent on that punt return that time. What speed and quickness that allows him to break through some of that coverage and picks up good yards. First down here. We'll take the snap from the shotgun. Looking to go down the field here. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. Well, the defense has to be depressed after that play because when you get a chance to get off the field, get a turnover, and get the offense Raider, off the Raider, field, Raider. man, you got to take Raider. advantage Watch of situations like that. Zebra, zebra, zebra. The Giants have had it at the 44. What a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. Well, they always say if you get your hands on the football, you got to make the catch. Yeah, right. The guy that made that rule up wasn't getting hit as he was trying hey, to catch man, the man, football. Man. Nice hit that time. Regular, regular, regular. Eli Manning will take it down to the center here. Third down and ten. They bring him down, and the offense fails to pick up a first down on three plays. They're going to 
go for it here on fourth and six. That's going to be a timeout charge to the offense. We need a no backup play. Are you letting them there? The offense is back really. on the field here for this fourth and six play. Watch the safety blitz. Watch the safety blitz. The Giants will take the snap from the 40. They're setting up screen. Yes. And Knew that play was going to work. The Saints might have been caught off guard there on that fourth down play. Well, why? Why would you be caught off guard in a situation like this? You always have to be ready on the Watch defensive the side. Watch that the time they were right. first and ten. Incomplete. This will be second down. Zebra, zebra, zebra. Manning's got, got two gun, tight gun, ends gun. on the field for this snap. Keeps it here. Incomplete. The hit jarred the ball loose. Ah, uh, there's nothing like a big hit. When you get it and it connects, it gets your defense some right, emotion. Right, right. Look at the guys, how they're jumping around. Hey, it gets everybody excited. Two tight ends on the field here. Zebra, zebra, zebra. Third and ten. <laughs> the Giants get a first down. You just can't expect your defensive backs to cover that ball. Uh, it's good coverage initially, but the quarterback had all day long, and sooner or later, these great wide receivers are going to get open. And Jennings going to take the handoff now. Lewis in on the tackle. If I'm on the defense... And the offense is this close to scoring. I'll tell you what I'm doing. I am sending everybody. I'm challenging. That play is going to be challenged. Challenge flag is out. Right, I'm going to stop and listen. Lost. I am valid immunes. Over the line. Touchdown, New York. The ball was dead at the end zone. I want to see if they agree. So he challenged the play and the coaches chat. Well, it looked like what I saw. I'm gonna up the volume speakers. There's a tap it so we can hear those calls. Does not pay off. Well, I, I agree with the head coach still. I would have made this challenge because it was so important to the outcome of the game, and it was a little bit of a gamble, but it was worth it. Second and goal to go. Runs it across for the touchdown. Well, I want to play for the touchdown, and I'll tell you in the NFL. There's so many good players on offense now, you can never have enough points. So keep padding on that lead. Good job. Good score. Josh Brown about to boot it down the field. Runs up to grab it at the four. Popped up the football. A huge turn of events. The ball's going back the other way. Yes. Jackson's there to make the tackle. Always hustle on the kick teams and always be alert. That football came loose. What a job by the kicking team falling on it and getting that ball. I want to see them call a challenge on that. Zebra, zebra, zebra. Zebra, zebra. Eli Mack will take it from the center. Man, Earl Beckham gets free. Browner almost got the interception. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it, you just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? All right. He's coming, he's coming. Split backfield okay, here. Back. Second down and ten. <laughs> then you're giving up back him. Giants in the end zone. Man, what a touchdown there for the offense. The quarterback just fires that football in there. Look at the defenders around the receiver. Yeah. But the receiver, big enough, tough enough to go up in there and make that catch. 
the Giants will kick it away momentarily. They were able to capitalize on great field position following the fumble, and they'll be hoping the defense can help them out like that once more. Spiller's got it. And he's tackled right at the 30-yard line after that return. They come to the line of scrimmage. First but down. this is for the channel. Well, let's go! 188! Head up! Mark Ingram carries the football. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Get ready! It's our time. 188! It's our time. The Saints take it from the 38. And Ingram is taking the handoff. In on the stop. Ingram's able to show everybody why he should get the football more. Good job that time. Finding his way and picking up the first down. I'm challenging that. And to tell you guys. But before I challenge it, I want the in-game volume up the other shit. These same speakers up to the same as the game but I'm gonna in-game commentary. There we go. You knew this was going to happen, and the coach disagrees with the call on the field. He's down. I hate to tell you guys, he was down. He down. After review of the play, the ruling on the field stands. Fuck. So the coach's challenge backfires. They'll lose the timeout, and they fail to overturn the call on the field. You know what you do in situations like this? You fire the guy upstairs who told him, throw the flag, coach. Well, what do you got to say now? It was a terrible call, a terrible decision, and you lose a timeout. And they go back to the round, brought down after a gain of six. And now we're done with the challenge. Here in New Orleans, and we'll we lost all of our challenge. Coming up, second down. And we don't even get a third one because we used our... Let's go! Up, man. Right the the second quarter is underway with this snap. They are all over them. Behind the line of scrimmage. And a loss of one. Let's see what they do on this third down situation. Quarters formation here for the defense. From the shotgun. Watson's got the catch and the first. Good job that time by the quarterback. Man-to-man -man coverage down the field. When you see it, you got to be accurate with the football. He was that time, and that's why we got the completion. Well, let's go! Red 38! Z! Z! First and ten. The run up with Mark Ingram. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. Well, that's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field and... My guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no well, doubt about it. Hey, anytime you see a star football player lying on the field, that makes everybody nervous. Mark Ingram carries the football, and he's tackled down after picking up the first. Ingram's a great running back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has well, three more chances. 188! First down and ten. Takes it again. Oh, the, we've got an injured player on the field. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. Let's go now to Danielle Bellini, who has the injury update. Guys, I just spoke with a Giants official. The good news is this is just a minor issue, but that being go. said, he's going to stay on the bench for a bit longer before heading back out on the field. Throwing now to his left. Ball is out. Oh, they cough up the football in the deep. A foot race to the end zone. He's at the 50, the 40, the 30, the 20, 
the 10, gonna take it home for the touchdown. This defense, they have some mindset, don't they? They practice it. Once they get the turnover, they try to take it all the way for the touchdown and they get it done that time. The Giants lined up now for the point after. He made it. <laughs> Both touchdowns. The Saints getting set to return to kickoff. Cooks got a chance for That's a nice and on the pudding. And the tackles made. The offense will start their drive from about the 31. The Saints are ready to take over now as their offense heads onto the field. <sighs> We're still waiting for the injury update. Probably Probably from the gun. Got the completion. And they tackle him down at the 37 yard line. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws, sooner or later that defense is going to come up. And when they come up, that's when you throw it over the top. Get ready. Line 88. Line 88. Let's go. Let's go. Mike, number 53. Mike. The Saints from the 37. Play action fake. Looking to throw. That catch will extend the drive. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. Jim, I know both you and I are hoping it's not serious. And once we find out, we'll tell everybody exactly what we know. Jim, I'll tell you, quarterbacks love it when the defense blitzes because all they have to do now is find one receiver, make an accurate throw. He did that time, and that's why he got a completion. Red 38! Red 38! I'm filing my head trainer after that one. I'm firing my head trainer after that because I saw Giants officials helping that New Orleans player. No gain. Great job. Well, let's go. Fred, 38. Fred, 38. Of course, he was injured by on my sideline, so I might be rushing. Well, the right side, Jim, the right tackle, and the right guard. They look confused. They don't know what to do, so they just get run over, and the quarterback falls down. Get ready. The Saints Red come to the line of scrimmage and empty out the backfield. Everyone split out wide. Incomplete as that ball sails out of bounds. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. Beckham, he's got a chance this time. This big return's gonna set up his team in excellent field position. When you're a good punt returner in the NFL, that's because you can catch the football and just kind of see the entire picture because everybody's all spread out. Good vision that time by the punt returner, and he picks up good yards. An extra tight end on the field for this one. Manning still got it on the play action. Almost intercepted that time. The defense did everything right that situation. They were in the right spot. They were smart. They read the quarterback's eyes, but they dropped the pass. It's now second down. All right, so this brings up back um, to the... Uh, and Cruz head. is a receiver in the slot. Manning's going to keep it. Going deep. Browner almost got the interception. Every quarterback in the NFL is going to have one or two passes a game. They can be picked off. Most of the time they're dropped. Trying this to hit. Time, that was a bad drop by the defense. Eli Manning will take it from the center here. Third down and ten. Breaks the tackle. And this will just go for an incompletion. This is what separates offensive lines in the NFL in obvious passing situations. Like this one on third down. Can you hold up and protect your quarterback to give you time to make those throws? Well, the answer to this one right now is no. They're in punting formation. Touchback now as the ball comes out to the 20. The Saints are ready to take over now and their offense heads oh onto the field. 
CJ Spiller is in the back. Get ready. Wide 88. Wide 88. Three step drop. He'll throw it over the middle. Almost intercepted. The best results. results. I know we've all heard this phrase before. That's why they're playing defense, because they can't catch. Hey, the coaches don't care about that. When you get an opportunity, they want you to make the catch. Get ready. Right, go ahead. Four down, four down, four down. Second and ten. Marcus Colston hauls it in. Good job by the quarterback that time. Makes the decision. Throws it short. It does not get the first down. But I promise you, third and short is a lot easier than having third and long. Takes the snap. We're about midway. Falls out. A recovery by the defense. He stacked up at that point. Well, that's what you call a takeaway. That time, the defense just hit the ball carrier so hard that he had to give the football up. And they lose it. Split backfield here. First down at the 34. The hit knocks the ball out incomplete. Second down following that incompletion. Watch the blitz. Watch the blitz. Manning's looking to go down the field here, but it's incomplete. I'm not going to say that was a good decision by the quarterback, but it will get the defense and wake them up and keep them alert to the fact that he is willing to throw the football down the field into some very risky coverage. Third and ten. Looking long. And there's a great catch. Well, once again, the offense is in the red zone. they got a big lead. I think it's up to this defense. Finally show a little toughness to try to stop them for once. First down, following the long play. And Jennick, the blowout continues. Another touchdown. I would bet... First and goal that the offense, about 90% of the time, is going to run the football. And what do they do here? They run it, and they get it done. That is power football at its best. The Giants are about to kick the football back, but it's the offense celebrating and the defense doing all the setup. That fumble recovery gave them great field position, setting up the score. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. It's first down as they head to the line. Double tight end formation. Get ready. Fred, 38. Hey. Just a quick drop back. He's got the catch. Charles is tackled down after a gain of seven. That's a nice round on the outside. Nice throw by the quarterback. Puts him in good position to keep moving and get a first down. Well, let's go. Fred, 38. Fred, 38. Hey. At second and three. Incomplete. Third down. I just had to hit the QB. Uh... Spiller takes his spot Get in the ready. backfield. Right, Tight 30 ends 30 in motion 30 here. 30. <laughs> incomplete. Number seven goes incomplete. <laughs> They're set to punt it away now. <laughs> They're gonna lose. We're gonna have a big rattle. Tackle down at the 42 yard line. I'm gonna like all mean by doing this right now. The Giants are running. set now for their next possession. Harris. First down at the 42. But I'm going to go with the uh, Manning's looking to go down the field here. Browner almost got the interception. Well, the defense has to be depressed after that play because when you get a chance to get off the field, get a turnover, and get the offense off the field, man, you got to take advantage of situations like that. Hey, hey, man, man, man. Eli Manning will take it from the center here. Second down and 10. 
looking across the middle underneath but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete it'll be third down and Jennings lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. Now. Airing it out. Very nearly intercepted. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it. You just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? Time is coming up, but first we reach the two-minute warning. Well, Jim, that was a good call by the offense. They took the knee there, and that's what I would have done, too. That's the right decision. Go in and have time, make some adjustments, and come out here and try to get it done in the second half. Now first and ten. Down the field. A near interception that time by Rogers Cobardi. The defense did everything right in that situation. They were in the right spot. They were smart. They read the quarterback's eyes, but they dropped the pass. Get ready. Pass. Run, 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 38. 38. Hey. Takes it from the gun. Hey. He has the grab, and they are in on Spiller. Well, I guess the best thing to say there, Jim, is they completed the pass, but it still did not get a first down. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. And Morgan's going to get set in the slot for the snap. From the gun. <laughs> Tries to get the feet down, but this will be ruled incomplete. Thomas Morstead will punt this one away. Beckham is going to look for space now. Going to be a penalty here. And that's a gain of 13. Holding. Put the holding on him. Personal foul. Clipping. Receiving team. Well, contact around the knees, and they flagged them for the clipping call. Uh, it, it, it did. It was a good call. I mean, listen, you got to hold your breath when you see plays like that. You just hope somebody doesn't get hurt. Watch the safety blitz. Manning's lined up two tight end set. First down at the 47. Manning's looking to go down the field here. Yeah. And they score again here to pad the lead. What a tough throw and catch into a tight spot right there for the touchdown. But in today's game, these players are so good that you have to throw it in traffic. They've got to make the catch. That time he did. Josh Brown about to boot it down the field. Taking this at their own Cooks five. Cooks got it on the return. The tackles made right around the 25 yard line. They come to the line and it's first down. Still scared of being shot. The Saints again. with an empty backfield look here. 38. Out of the shotgun formation. Incomplete as he was looking short. Second down coming up. He's and dead. Morgan's lined up now as a slot Move receiver. Right, 38, right. Drop back, shotgun formation. Looking long to Colston. He's in the clear. The 10, nobody Touchdown. was going to catch him there. Touchdown. What a terrible job by the defense. That time, nobody even covers the receiver. He is wide open down the field. And hey, nice job by the quarterback going through his progression. I he finds care. the open guy and gets a touchdown pass. Sad. The Saints kicking team comes out now as the offense takes a break, and they deserve one after going down the field, mainly through the air with over 70 yards passing. And a flag is down, and he runs it out to about the 27 before he's taken down. Personal foul, 
Clipping. Receiving team. Always one of the more dangerous moments out on the field when you see a flag thrown for Clipping. Yeah, it is, Jim. The player you are blocking or clipping can't protect himself. And when you go down low on those legs and do that, it's a dangerous play. It's definitely worthy of the call. Flag is out. Could have been intercepted. Person, uh, match interference probably. I know. Personal foul. Clipping. Offense. That penalty is, of course, going to be accepted by the defense. What? How can you get clipping on the offense? Position. And Jennings lined up directly behind the quarterback here. All that I'm pissed about was it was clipping on offense. Incomplete. Well, you must on the offensive side throw the football deep three or four times a game. That time they're just not able to connect on the deep throw. After the incomplete pass, oh, back um, it brings up second down. They load it up You're now. Bring out the jumbo formation. Keeps it on the play. Manning's looking to go down the field here. Clutch catch. There's just so few quarterbacks who know how to throw it high and far anymore. Nice job that time by the quarterback. That throw was right on the money. The offense is set right, at Cruz. the line for the first down. And then you have this thing new. This play is set up by the long gainer. Play action. Launches it down the field. But it falls incomplete. I think the coach has got to call more of these plays. That's a good job of at least trying to get the big play, but they cannot get the completion on that long throw. Failing to complete that one. So second right. down here. Two, one more snap and halftime. Manning's got the football after the play fake. Going for the deep ball. That ball has been picked off. Oh, nice pick! Nice pick! So that's going to do it for the first half. Giants are up in this one. Giants ready to kick it away. Catches it at the two and starts his return. And that return ends rather quietly, short of the 20. Let's mark him at the 16. They face first down. And a bunch of injuries. Nickel formation here for the defense. Get ready. 38. And here we go. The first half of the second half. Moore's is an animal on that play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Spillers lined up in a single back formation. Well, let's go. Second down and 11. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Well, they complete the pass, Jim, but doesn't get the first down. Sooner or later, you got to throw one down the field. They've come out in the dime package. Get ready. Right. 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 38. Right. 38. Right. Right. Third and nine. And this will be incomplete. It'll be a three and out. The punter awaits the snap. Beckham's got it right. on the return. If we, I can't see any more of this. This is getting way out of hand. I'm just going to super sim this quarter and a few sessions. And up to the two minute warning in the next quarter.
We won. Now it's time for me to start editing this. See you next week. Bye.